<laughs> it just came in the mail. This is not a sponsored video. I just bought this myself for that much right there out of my own wallet. And I've been looking for a new mic solution ever since my shotgun mic for my Canon DSLR broke when it fell off the car. And I'm hoping this is it. For the longest time I was looking at the Rode 2 and then DJI announced this and I wasn't in a big hurry so I just waited and waited and finally they just released it and out there all over the interwebs there's all these paid product or sponsored reviews by a lot of different YouTubers. A lot of them are my friends. I trust what they say. I'm gonna open this and just do a quick little once over and see what's inside of it and then over the next few weeks we're gonna be using it not only like this with my DSLR making videos like this, but we're going to hook it up to the Insta360 X2. And as soon as I get some kind of cage or something that holds it for the GoPro 10, we're gonna use it for that as well. Now, one cool thing is I can go ahead and use this now with the GoPro 10 without a cage and just use it hooked up to like my shirt, sort of like I have this little hidden lavalier mic right there. You might not be able to see it because I'm wearing black on black, but these record directly in so I can actually record to the device take the audio from the GoPro, sync them together in post, and decide which one is better. So that will be an upcoming video soon. So make sure you're subscribed to the channel. Click that bell notification when I do get more into in-depth videos comparing this with the GoPro and other devices. You don't miss them. Now let's go ahead and get this thing open and see what the build quality actually is like. Where's that knife when you need one? Come on now. Oh shit, my laptop. DJ always reminds me of Apple, the way they box things. much smaller than I thought they would be. Fuzzies, sweet. God, this light is so bright. The first thing I gotta say is that they are much smaller than I thought they would be. I opened this up and when I pulled this little guy out, I think it's about half the size that I imagine the Rode Go To mic is or whatever. I am not positive on that, so do not hold me to it. But my first impressions are that these are small. They're like small, like smaller than my nose, this giant honker. They go in and out of the case very well. They fit great. Everything seems to fit great. My biggest concern was that when I'm snowboarding and I had this hooked up with the USB-C, it's like sort of a pin thing. I thought it was just magnetic and it's not. This slides in there like so and it's in there and locked in there. My worry was that this would come apart while I was doing activities, action sports, things like that, but that's that's not going anywhere. And that's a really good thing because you can plug this in directly with the DJI Action 2. You can plug it directly into something like the Insta360 ONE X2. And with a little messing around, you can plug it into the GoPro 10 or possibly the GoPro Max. The entire unit syncs together when you put it in there. Also, it charges in this unit. My first impressions are pretty positive. I'm not gonna actually use it in this video. If you wanna see that, make sure you do subscribe. Like I mentioned earlier, the build quality on this is really, really nice. It comes with a couple cattails. Like I showed you earlier, my Rode shotgun mic is kaput. It broke off. I mean, I could still put it there and tape it on, but it's not the housing, the mount for it. Maybe Roe to send me one. I don't know. I tried reaching out to him to see what kind of warranty they do, but it's my fault. The damn thing fell off my car and 
broken half. It did come with a couple of extra wires, a regular eighth inch jack wire as well as a USB-C extended wire. I have millions of these now. It also came with a little carrying bag to throw that in there, throw your fuzzies in there, throw your wires in there, and everything's contained just like that. Hopefully it works as good as I'm hoping it will. The audio I used to get off of this was really good. So hopefully it compares with Rode. We'll find out in an upcoming video. So thanks for watching. Ho hopefully you guys, uh, if you were wondering what the build quality of the DJI, uh, what do they even call it? Just the DJI mic was? Now you know. I'll see you in the next one. Thanks.